Hey there, it's me, Kayvon, by far your favorite half Persian, half Scottish comedian. Half Persian, half Scottish, Harry Potter. Hey, today I thought we'd do a comedy rewind where we go back in the vault and look at some of my older comedy clips. Now, here's the deal. Comedy clips from that long ago are not gonna have the best quality. So if you're not a huge fan of comedy and digging into the archives, log off now. I don't want you to watch this. But for the rest of you, enjoy this from 2013. This is a joke I've been working on for about four years. So imagine I wrote it in 2008 or nine, and it just kind of highlights the difference between the way black people laugh mm -hmm. and the way white people laugh. Absolutely. And it gives you a little insight as to what it might look like if you make a black person very angry. Now, of course, these are just jokes, but here's the problem with comedians today. They're afraid to joke about different cultures. They're too busy trying to get offended by it. And in my opinion, culture and ethnicity is the best thing in the world to joke about and the dumbest thing in the world to get offended by. So if you get offended easily, you're an idiot. We're here to tell jokes. Comedians and people who work together have always joked around. I used to work with a Mexican guy, a Greek guy, and an Italian guy in an office. So it already sounds like a joke. A Greek guy, a Mexican guy, and a Persian guy walk into a bar. That's what we did. And we would make fun of each other left and right. And we became better friends because of it. To this day, we still laugh. And the problem is with so many people in the workforce today, they're so busy pretending to be offended. They're forgetting to be good people, enjoyable to be around, and nobody likes you. So here is some jokes with me, your favorite half Persian, half Scottish guy, telling jokes about black people to a group in Orange County. And look, ooh, alert the media. Everybody's enjoying it. And at the end of the show, everybody got along. Shocker. You people disgust me. Orange County, right? Oh, yeah! Barely, though, right? <laughs> you can't spell barely without B-R-E-A. You know what I mean? I love Orange County. The hottest chicks are in Orange County. In fact, the ugliest chick in Orange County is the hottest girl in Albuquerque right now. It's amazing! I've been around the world. I have seen it! First of all, do we have any black dudes here make some noise? Black people? I thought there'd be a lot more than that. I see we've sprinkled them throughout the audience. That's always good. <laughs> you gotta do that, because if there's too many white people, they don't laugh enough. Put a black dude somewhere, sprinkle them in there, loosen up the place a little bit. Because white people laugh like this. <laughs> <laughs> that was too much. I mean, Roger, did you enjoy that dude? <laughs> but you make a black dude laugh, watch BET, they get into that. <laughs> So they're there for your reference. Look around, people. They're there for you. I mean, they're the best. I love them at the shows. I did one joke. I said, you ever notice you piss off a black guy? It looks like they're going to wash a car. Nobody knew what the f*** I was talking about. But try it sometime. Step on their shoe like, oh, hell no, player. I know you didn't just step on. I'm going to let that slide. But do that shit again and watch what happens to your punk ass. That was a Cadillac by the looks of it. <laughs> Told you. Now, if you like that video, I have 400 more on youtube.com slash Comedy. Do me a favor, hit subscribe and click share. That's the easiest way to help me out. Now, if you want to go to the next level, make a one-time donation on gofundme.com slash tanksgod. It's easy. Or, my favorite, join me on Patreon at Comedy. That's how you can keep these videos coming for a long time. And if you like the message that we all need to laugh together and get along, then you're going to want to support me. If you enjoy the mainstream media message, that everyone should be offended, everyone's out to hurt each other, and we live in the most racist time of all, and everyone's a victim, well, you should log off my page. I don't want you here. Bye.